Hey everybody, Rob here for Southwest Florida Television. I am back for part two of my Sunday morning beach walk at Del Norwegans Pass State Park in beautiful North Naples, Florida. Temperature's 80 degrees now. The sun's just peeking in and out from behind the clouds. I'm standing on the boardwalk at the north end of Area 2. Just before ending Part 1, I was out there, right out there in the water, and we were surrounded by Sheep's Head again and followed a snook up the beach. That was kind of neat. Absolutely glorious morning here. Thanks for hanging out with me. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for being a friend. We did see one new nest on the beach so far this morning. Up at the north end of area one, we saw a loggerhead sea turtle nest Number 30, number 30. So that's good news. We're just gonna walk up to the north and see if there's any more nests. Any, <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> See if nest number 31 might be up there. One never knows. There's a few more people here on the beach than there were earlier this morning. It is a gorgeous morning. It's probably going to rain later today. We are starting to fall into our summer rain patterns already. Rain in the afternoons, almost like clockwork. Kind of early for that to be starting, but we need the rain. Yesterday afternoon, I came out here for a little while, for about an hour, and did a live feed. Watching the thunderstorms offshore. Up to the north of us yesterday afternoon, up in Benita, up that away, had a water spout. That's like a tornado out in the water. Very, very cool to watch. There's some videos and photos of that on Facebook, scattered throughout Facebook. If you get on, uh, if you follow Matt Devitt, M-A-T-T, -T, Matt Matthew Devitt, D-E-V-I-T-T, -T, Matt Devitt, he's the chief meteorologist at Wink TV. You can see some of the interesting weather we have down here. He shares some neat photos on his Facebook page. I'll share his stuff occasionally on my page here. There is the skybox over to my right. An empty skybox right now. Good news for Gary if he ever wants to come back down here. There's your skybox, Gary. Still there. If you care. <laughs> There's a 
Darn flies, still got those flies. Mosquitoes up in the woods. That's the one thing. If you come out here to the park, it's beautiful. But if you're going to be up in the picnic areas, you definitely want to have your bug spray up in there. water is gorgeous. Look at that. Look at that. Nice and clear. Here comes a big snook. You're going to see a dark shadow come by me in the water. Ah, it's turning out. Now it's turning out. Darn it, I was gonna come right up here close to shore. That's why I just froze. He turned around and went the other way. Well, there he is. See that dark shadow? Look, we're, uh, There's lots and lots of fish out here. I just think it's so fascinating. It never gets old to me. It never gets old. I just love seeing all the marine life out here. Did you find a sand dollar? Yeah. Oh, the baby, that's all right. Still counts. <laughs> My favorite views are from out here in the water, looking back at the beach. Look how empty it is here. Nice big stretch of, stretch of empty open beach here. This is the south end of Area 4 Beach. There's no parking lot adjacent to this stretch of beach here. That's why it's usually kind of less crowded because there's no parking lot. You kind of kind of walk to it. There are picnic tables back in the trees along this area, but no parking. So it usually tends to be a little less crowded down here. Except on holiday weekends. Forget about coming out here. Fourth of July weekend. Man, there goes another snook. There have been so many fish going by this morning. He went right into the shade, into the shadows. So I'm sure we'll see more of them. But look at that water. Is that not gorgeous? Here's, here's a snook. If I stand here, is he gonna come over to me? I see him in the, dis the distance here. Nope.
What I really want to see is a dolphin. <laughs> a dolphin comes swimming up to me. Look at those clouds out there. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Hit that share button. Come on. Where's everybody at? The only good excuse you can have from not being here is that you're at church. If you're at church, you're excused. That's the only excuse I'm accepting. There's a snook right down there, right down there in front of me. Look really close there, swimming ahead of me. Trusty can see it there. He's getting up and a little further away from me. We saw a bigger one than this earlier. Got right behind him, just like this. Seems like when you get behind them, they don't know you're there. <laughs> the snook stalker. We're stalking the snook. paparazzi in the snook. They're tasty, mighty tasty, those snook. You gotta get them just the right size, and I don't even know what the season is for snook, but they are delicious. Smoked, I love them smoked. Smoked snook. school a little there's a little bait fish down here swimming by too many ripples in the water to see them though in the camera they just get lost in all the little ripples and reflections water's about knee deep where I'm at here my tide is still going out Almost up to where I came in this morning, up on the boardwalk in area four. Area Roy up there by those trees, area Roy.
where I just hit a really warm pocket of water. It's kind of interesting the way the water changes temperature as you walk along. It feels five degrees warmer. Good morning. How are you guys doing? You gonna go fishing? All right. Fisherman's Sal. If you're liking what you're seeing, send some stars. Morning therapy, walking out here in the water. I could stand out here all day long, shrivel up like a prune, but. I didn't explore this beach from here up to the north end here. So if there's another sea turtle nest, it's gonna be up here somewhere. Keeping my fingers crossed, but not holding my breath. You know what? I see the rangers up ahead of me. I see the rangers up there. Maybe, maybe nest 31. They've been there for a while now. Nest 30 was a tough one. It took Ranger James and Ranger Steve a little while to find that clutch of eggs. They're usually pretty good about finding them fast, not having to do too much digging. It is beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Colors are gorgeous. We're in a little clearing right now, which is nice. Got some blue sky up there.
find any sand dollars out here. If you dig along in the sand, is where you'll find the sand dollars. A lot of times you'll see them up on top of the sand, but if you just kind of run your hands through the sand out here, especially at low tide here, you'll find some sand dollars out on the sandbars. a new cage. Ranger James just finishing up there. Sky is beautiful. Beautiful with those thin wispy clouds up there. White wispy, white wisps, the white wisps. something set up over on the beach here again in area four there was a wedding here when i came out yesterday afternoon roy would have loved to have been here for that right in front of his tree they had a wedding running late today on his beach patrol having to check these nests out but by George looks like we got nest 32 here sweet sweet wow this is interesting she just laid him last night. He just yeah, covered the nest up. I know. Thank you. So we had, she, first she came up. Let's see. This is where she came out of the water here. And it looks like she was going to dig her nest here. And then she decided to move up a little further. Sweet. And again, just like down before at nest 30, See there are little clusters of nests. There's three nests right here. So this is going to be nest 31. But they're like in little clusters. Three nests, five nests. Nest number 31. Awesome, awesome news right there. How cool is that? How cool is that? There's Kevin. Kevin up on the beach picking up trash, darn it. Working hard.
All right, 31 nest. Hallelujah, huh? They need to keep on coming. Keep on coming. New one. Yep. Is that a new one? It's a brand spanking new? Brand new, shiny. What about that one right there that they didn't shiny. check? Yeah. You just walked right over the coral tracks. Oh, the tractor? <laughs> Is there any more up the beach? No. Two today. Two today. Two today. 31 nests. Gotta love it. Yeah. Man, it's nice out here. I might stay out right now. Keep your uniform on. Show some authority. Yeah. <laughs> I don't roll like that. You, you know, don't roll like that? I strip it off as soon as I pit the clock. I saw your post this morning, oh, going beautiful. out to do some rangering. Yeah, ranger up this morning. Ranger up. Ranger up. Man. Seeing gopher tortoises? No, actually. You know what? They've been sold the last few days. I yeah, I haven't seen any lately either. I haven't. And that whole, I think that, they, they got rid of, they don't live in there anymore. I think they evacuated it. That went over there? Yeah. Because usually when the foliage grows around it, they're not that, there anymore to... Yeah. Eat it or I thought that too here, but then all of a sudden I saw one sitting here. This Maybe little one right up there. Maybe you take it over after a while. I guess they use them every year. You know, you don't even know if that's... No. Like you say, there's so many entrances and exits and oh, those yeah, things. They could be coming up anywhere. It's only one gopher tortoise here. Yeah, <laughs> I know. You can use them all. Yep. <laughs> <Go ahead. laughs> oh, boy. Yeah, I don't know where our little tortoises went. They're here, we just haven't caught them. See if he's out. Well, now that I say that, there's a little burrow right here. Let's go check and see if he's out. I thought I had walked way past it. Let's see if anybody's sitting out here this morning. Nope. Nobody out here this morning. I don't see any fresh tracks either. Nobody out. Oh, look at that view. Is that not spectacular? Is that not breathtaking? Area five here. I'm in area five. Go up to the dead trees up here in area five. Get in the shade. It's starting to warm up nicely. Well, I don't see any more sea turtle tracks up here.
<clears throat> and nice clear water. Sal, how you doing? Getting ready to catch the big one. Yeah, how was Sanibel? Sharks? Black tips or? Yeah, black tips, shots. Wow. Trout? Nice. Really? Man. Did you keep them? It's off season, Snook's off season. Oh, bummer. There's a lot of, I've been seeing a lot of sheep's head out here. Yeah. Huge schools of them, yeah. huge schools. You need shrimp to catch those. Some big ones, too. The mackerel too. Yeah, every time I get the Spanish mackerel, I think of that one. Ah, that that <laughs> right. It swam back up the. You had a nice story for that one. Yep. That was he was kind of lost there. He was yeah, stuck on between the beach and the sandbar. That was funny. <laughs> You're going the wrong way. <laughs> yep. <laughs> All right, I'll see you on the way back. Hey, good morning. Good morning, lots of people. Huh? Yeah, lots of people. <laughs> Not so bad. I mean, lots of people, but having their little special get togethers here. Photos and whatnots. I can see the steel manatee from way over here. It's way out, straight out in front of me. You can see a dark spot in the water from it out there. Very cool. I think I gotta let this camera cool down for a little while. Which means I'll probably end this live feed and start another one up in a little while. I might walk down to Wiggins Pass, walk down or up the pass and bring you another live feed. I don't know where I'm at with batteries, but we'll see. So stay tuned, I'll be back later this morning. 
with live feed number three. Give you time to have breakfast, make some donuts. If you're liking what you're seeing, you can send some stars. I see, it's got a few stars there. I can barely see the screen. Looks like I got a good number of stars there. Thank you. you guys are awesome. Of course, if you'd like to send a tip, those go a long, long way. And Facebook doesn't take any of that money like they do the stars. Yeah, so thank you. If you'd like to send a tip, you can find a link to my PayPal account and my Venmo account info in the description of this post. Remember, Venmo, fee free. Great way to send money to friends and family, Venmo. Well, if I don't see you later, have a awesome, awesome Sunday. Be sure to tell your friends about Southwest Florida Television. Help spread the word and share the love. Bringing awesome people just like you together in the mornings. One beach walk at a time. So, until next time, stay safe, stay healthy, and stay strong. Tally ho, my friends, tally ho. For Southwest Florida Television, I'm Rob Stan. God bless.